CNAP, setting new standards in hemodynamic monitoring for use in research, the operating room or emergency department, intermediate care, and all situations that require continuous blood pressure monitoring without cannulating the patient. CNAP utilizes a simple, non-invasive setup to provide a high-fidelity blood pressure tracing. With validation on thousands of patients, we have proven that CNAP can match an invasive arterial line in terms of accuracy and the morphology of blood pressure tracings. The setup process for CNAP is easy. To select a finger cuff, either large, medium, or small, Simply align the patient's fingers with the color label on the forearm unit and then connect the finger cuff. Open the strap and slide the patient's finger into the cuff, making sure the cuff is positioned on the proximal limb and not over the finger joints. Finally, verify the slider on the forearm unit is in the middle position before closing the strap. This will allow patient hand movement. CNAP uses a traditional upper arm cuff for calibration at heart level. The upper arm cuff can be placed either on the ipsilateral or contralateral arm of the patient. Make sure to align the marker with the radial artery and to check the size indicator. After patient setup, you can continue the current measurement or select a new patient. Make sure to select the proper patient category, either adult or pediatric, as the selection will have an impact on inflation pressures for the upper arm cuff. The perfusion index shows the blood flow in the patient's fingers. When the perfusion index turns green, it indicates sufficient perfusion to start a measurement. The upper arm cuff will inflate and display the patient's brachial pressure, which is then calibrated with the finger cuff. The CNAP signal will be displayed continuously. In scientific research and clinical routine, it's essential to provide reliable solutions and reproducible data. CNAP is designed and equipped with a number of features to provide consistent results. The integrated upper arm cuff calibrates pressures to heart level. Through the design of finger cuffs, the CNAP sensor setup is simple. The double barrel design also means that long measurements are possible, even up to 24 hours, as the device can switch fingers automatically. The forearm assembly allows hand movement during measurement. CNAP easily interfaces with existing patient monitors. To connect with a patient monitor, use the blood pressure wave out connection and provided cable. The CNAP's blood pressure waveform will now be displayed on the patient monitor. Make sure to zero the patient monitor's pressure input upon establishing the connection. To interface CNAP with other data acquisition systems, use the auxiliary analog output. An analog signal of the blood pressure tracing is available with ranges from zero to five volts or plus or minus five volts. To download measured beat data and blood pressure tracings digitally, you can simply connect a USB storage device to the CNAP. Two of the biggest trends in healthcare today are technologies that provide continuous data and are non-invasive to the patient. The CNAP monitors non-invasive beat-to-beat blood pressure monitoring can help improve patient safety and outcomes while also saving costs.